Hello everyone. I hope you all are doing well at home. I am Rashmi and here to take your chemistry class. So we will start chapter 2 chemical bonding. Chemical bond. It is the force of attraction between any two atoms in a molecule to maintain stability. So actually uh, what is chemical bond? It is the force that holds atom together. Okay. And next thing is why do atoms combine? Atoms combine because they want to become stable. They want to complete the outermost shell by octet or doublet rule. On the basis of this, chemical bond is categorized into three categories. First is electrovalent, it is also known as ionic, second is covalent and third is coordinate. So here first I will discuss electrovalent bond. Electrovalent bond is always formed between metals and non-metals. As you know that metals have the tendency to lose electron and non-metals have the tendency to gain electrons. So there will be transfer of electron from metal to non-metal. And the second one is covalent bond. Covalent bond is always formed between non-metals and non-metals and there will be mutual sharing of electrons due to energy concentration as you know that non-metals has the tendency to gain electrons so there will be mutual sharing further covalent bond is categorized into three categories first is single covalent second uh, double and then triple in single covalent bond each atom contribute one electron for sharing and in double covalent bond, each atom will contribute two electrons for sharing, mutual sharing. And in the triple covalent bond, each atom will contribute three electrons for mutual sharing. And the third category is coordinate bond. Coordinate bond is also formed by the sharing of electrons. But here two conditions are there. First condition is that one atom must have lone pair of electrons. Lone pair means the electrons which are not shared with any of the atoms and the another atom must have the shortage of at least one pair of electron then there will be sharing and here the sharing uh, exists between atom and ion. Atom here the only uh, one atom will contribute electrons for sharing and other will also share that electron the, uh, only one atom will contribute electron not other uh, so this kind of sharing is called covalent uh, sorry coordinate bond and uh, in the next video i will discuss the examples of electrovalent covalent and coordinate bond dot and orbital structure I am going to explain chapter 2 chemical bonding. Chemical bond. It is the force of attraction between any two atoms in a molecule to maintain stability. Here I will explain three kinds of chemical bond. One is first is electrovalent or ionic, second covalent and third coordinate. Electrovalent bond is formed by the transfer of electron. Covalent it is formed by the sharing of electrons and coordinate it is also formed by the sharing of electrons the difference between covalent and coordinate is that here in co covalent each atom will give electrons for sharing but here only one atom will give both the electrons for sharing and this atom should belong to co covalent molecule now the uh, electrovalent bond is formed between metal and non-metal, covalent is formed between non-metal and non-metal and coordinate between ion and an atom, an atom should belong to covalent molecule. Covalent compound further divided into three categories, single, double, triple. In single, each atom provide one electron for sharing. In double, each atom will provide two electrons for sharing. And in triple, each atom will provide three electrons for sharing. Further, covalent bond is also divided on the basis of polarity. First is polar and second one is non-polar covalent compound. In non-polar covalent compound, 
electrons are equally distributed between the atoms because their electron activity is same almost same and in polar covalent compound the electrons are not distributed equally due to the electronegativity difference these two electrovalent and covalent you have done in ninth and same uh, the material is same here so we will discuss uh, third type coordinate bond it is also known as coionic bond because it has the properties of covalent as well as ionic bond so here this one is ion this one is this one is covalent molecule the dot structure of water and here oxygen is having the uh, uh, oxygen is having electrons these are called lone pair which are not shared with any of the atom h positive will combine with water and it will give the structure like this and here positive sign it can also be represented by like this and this bond is shows is shown that the electrons both the electrons are provided by oxygen for sharing and these are the covalent bond this one is coordinate i hope you all have understood well thank you